What's good, YouTube? This your boy, Money Mitch TV, coming to you straight up the hip. I know I'm kind of late on this uh, piece of information. Um, I was reading some stuff about DeMarcus Cousins saying that he is flattered that NBA teams are talking about him in trade rumors. So I think DeMarcus Cousins should be flattered because his name holds a lot of value because he's a rare talent. He's an actual big man. He can post up, he can rebound, block shots, and he can shoot mid-range jumpers. He has a wide versatility to his game. Also, I think, you know, if DeMarcus Cousins go to another team, go to like a team like uh, the New York Knicks, which I have mentioned on uh, another video, which I'm going to post that link in the description. But another team I think he should go to is the Boston Celtics. And the reason why I said the Boston Celtics, because Danny Ainge has all of those assets. He has multiple draft picks where he can give to the Kings and the Kings uh, can just give away DeMarcus Cousins. And really, if Danny Ainge use his uh, brain, he will be able to finesse the Kings. Uh, out of DeMarcus Cousins and pretty much just give all the draft picks to the Kings so the Kings can start all over and the Boston Celtics get DeMarcus Cousins which that will be a good trade but to some people that will be a, a uneven trade but if you think about it you trade a star to a team that needs to win now then you give the other team assets to win later down the road which pretty much will benefit both teams so that's how I looked at it from um, that end also in other NBA news I just saw that the Players Association and the NBA have came to agreement for uh, the bargaining agreement deal so and it looks like in the next few years players is going to be making a ridiculous amount of money so don't be surprised you start hearing players like like uh, Thabo Cephalosha making seventy five million dollars, or or Damian Lillard gets two hundred million dollars, or you see DeAndre Jordan getting one hundred and fifty million dollars. Don't be surprised when you see those type of numbers pop out for players. That's you know that's role players and don't be surprised you see 200 million dollar contracts for players as all-stars and never won a championship and i think that would be good for the league that you know more money will be you know dished out to the players but yeah like comment and subscribe tell me what you think about demarcus cousins and the collecting a bargain agreement for uh the nba also uh, this your boy Money Mitch TV and I'm out.